Come on here. believe Ryan how much garbage we have here actually I already have I filled up half of the garbage uh, dumpster my pickup truck shit has been here for years do not buy any antique shit it doesn't sell at least not at this moment Best lanterns came from a haunted house <laughs> look they're spinning by themselves <laughs> They're haunted. This whole room is haunted. Remember the baby stroller? Haunted. Everything oh. is haunted here. That's why it's not selling. Oh God. 75% off. Haunted. Vicky, sell something. Okay. Try. <laughs> how you doing? Good, how are you? What can I do for you? I got a nail gun here. I'm not going to sell or trade or whatever. Master for some. Yeah. What are you looking to get out of it? I got quite a few guns at the moment. Yeah. You know, and this is that Menards brand, right, not the right, best. Right. Yeah, I know. I mean, what are you looking for? Um, I mean, it's like, what is it, like ninety dollars a minute? You know, forty. Forty, fifty bucks. Maybe fifty in trade. If. Um. I'm gonna be honest with you. You got twenty-five bucks here for me, or I'm gonna pass. Okay. Just because I got yeah. probably about eight, nine guns, that's and cool. this is lower grade, you yeah. know. So no, it's totally up to you. Oh. I mean, but that's gonna be kind of max what I can offer you. You know? Yeah. You can. Could you do like thirty? In I can't. I'm okay. just it's supply and demand. Right. You know, right if right. I got few laying on a shelf. Right. No, that's cool. So it's up to that's you, man. Fine. I was saying I do it. Too. You want to do it? We can use it for the show. Yeah, I'll hang on to it. Okay, yeah. I mean, you know, yeah. Oh, just cool. for that kind of money, you should yeah. probably keep it. You know, it's just, yeah. yeah. I want to show you guys really quick. A lot of times, I will post like big, bulky items like this Pelican case, heavy duty, uh, durable case for moving, you know, some kind of high end equipment for a local pickup. Now, this thing is not super heavy. It's probably about 20, 25 pounds, uh, but it's bulky. So we did local pickup and the guy messaged me would I uh, would I ship this to the East Coast if he provides uh, the label and I said yeah absolutely no problem so he uh, he emailed me his own uh, FedEx label we just slept it on as you can see there was a lot of labels on this before um, yeah so a lot of times you can just advertise local pickup and if people want it bad enough they'll message you not knowing if i had cancer or not and you having to go through all these surgeries and tests. now is it in your house or is it at the storage unit well two of the things is at the storage unit and uh -huh. a lot of it's at my house i have like a tricycle from the 30s yeah it's the guy at schwinn said you could get 400 for that all day long oh me. go ahead sorry yeah that i have so many antiques and I have these opera glasses. I've never seen them before. They're awesome. They're from the 1800s. They're on the case. Just really unique stuff. And you know, I'm, I am want to get gold, diamonds. I just want to unload everything because my house became like a hoarder's over when I was sick. Okay. So I can't, and I've always had a clean house. So it makes me feel so good just to get rid of this stuff. Well, and it's like, here, I'll throw in a diamond ring. Number. Just if you take everything. I don't want I'll anybody to say this and this. I, I need it all taken. Here, take this diamond ring. Take this gold, you know. And I have, you know, like, I have a... Uh, I well, have let me come over and look at it. And if, if I'm interested, you know, I okay. might shoot you an offer on everything, you know. Okay, because you probably know people who would take all the different things. A lot of things. Some of it, like, you know, a lot of antiques right now, I'm not actually taking it in. But you probably know uh, where you But I know some people okay. that would. You right. Know? I like your glasses. Yeah. Why? Okay. I think the last time yeah, I was in here, I said they were the purple. Or, no? no, I just changed them. Actually, they have that purple tint right now to them. Uh, 
that helps to block the the UV that comes off of the monitors when you work on oh. computers because I'm on computer a lot. Right, right. Because I was getting these headaches, so now it helps. Good. But it gives that weird tint on a glass. It's pretty, I like it. <laughs> it's, it's very good. Okay, we need to find it. Oh! You know what I'm talking about? Yes! <laughs> okay. It's sold. Okay. Alright, what number was it? Hold on. It's in here somewhere. Oh, I didn't look what number. Okay. I'll find it. Mm -hmm. Hey, bye, bunny. Hey, boy. Four C hard Mercedes. Yeah. Bunch of Mercedes. We got a bunch of Mercedes. Thor. Oh, that's a key. Playboy Bunny. Playboy Bunny. Oh, I'm starting to lose hope. How many in Playboy Bunnies? Lots, and we have more. Scissors. Just... That's crazy. Yeah, a little bicycle. Scissors. It's in here, right? Come on. Dice. Dice. There it is, on the bottom, of Make course. sure it says uh, number 35 when we... Okay. Awesome. Today I'm selling like weird stuff on eBay. Uh, I'll show you guys a few, few things that I just sold. Sold these. Uh, these are like uh, advanced mouth spray moisturizers. Uh, we are selling them either by the case. I got a bunch of cases here. They actually came out of a, out of a dumpster. A guy brought them to me. He said he found them all in the dumpster. So I'm selling five of these. Um, they're not expired or anything. Five of these, I think, for like ten bucks. And we paid like ten cents a piece. Actually, no, I'm sorry. Five of these for $20. $20. Then I sold this switch power supply by Radio Shack. I think we paid like 10 bucks. Sold for uh, 45 bucks. Red Wings um, with missing inserts inside. A little bit beat up, but huge size, size 14. Bottoms, the soles are really good. These sold for 75 bucks. And then uh, Paladin tools. This is for testing, I think, uh, uh, either cable or uh, camera systems, some kind of kid. I don't even know what it is. This sold for 65 bucks. Just selling some weird stuff today. You look very important there, like you're looking, working on something. What's going on? Well. I just sold this through OfferUp. When you post something, they ask you if you want to do shipping. So, so you... I selected, yes, I want to do shipping. They ask you what size. I select the size based off weight. And I just accepted an offer for what we're asking. And they say that the shipping is at no cost to us. So they send a prepaid shipping label through uh, Gmail. So, but now you had to put in like dimensions or the weight or anything no, of this just, item? No, they, they have little different weight brackets, like zero to three pounds, uh, five pounds to eight pounds or something like that. And you select how much it weighs basically. Okay. And then uh, when you get an offer, they say, okay, this person offered this much money plus shipping costs. So they're paying for the prepaid shipping label that's being sent to our email. And we just print it out, put it in a box or envelope, slap it on and ship it out, right? Yeah, I mean, I, I still got to hammer out the details, but I believe that's all so we got So that's our first sale on OfferUp using shipping labels from them. Yeah, so we'll have to see how it goes. I mean, it's, yeah. it's new to me, so... What are you doing? I'm taking pictures. Uh, I opened this because it was addressed to me. But actually, it's 
from Mike, but it says no peeking, read other side. And then, then when you turn it around it says Pete, this is for Victoria. If it's not her size or she wishes to let it, you have it. I am okay with it. Thanks for all the tips, blah blah blah. So go ahead and open it. I don't know what it is. Mike. I'm curious to see what it China. is, so <laughs> that's why you came. <laughs> He's like, I want to see it. This one's open this right now. So there's no peeking. Well, then you can't peek. All right, how does this open? This is bad deal. Um, right now, you know me, it's a resale shop. I'm going to reuse the bag, right? No. You can't reuse that. <laughs> I can. I like my bag. So nice. Somebody's thoughtful. Let's see. Let's see what I'm doing. <gasps> oh, it's so good in the hood. Oh, I love it. Oh my god. Who did this? My. This my, my note. Well, show what it is. We don't even know what it is yet. It's all good in the hood. Oh my god. It is big so size though. Yeah, but yeah. You oh can, my you, god, it's so cute. You can sleep in it though. I will. <laughs> oh my god. That is so sweet. Is that the cutest? Uh no comment. I'm glad you like it. <laughs> We're not gonna get into this again. I love it. Thanks Mike, she loves it. I love it. So are you happy with 350 on there? I'm very happy. That's awesome. I'm gonna film it really quick. It's a cool piece. I mean, you don't find stuff like this often, you know? Sounds good, plays good. I'm surprised you fit that thing in your uh, little Honda. I'm surprised too. Yeah, it's a, it's a Khan electric band. This is probably what, 60s or early 70s? It's uh, 70s, I think. 70s, yeah. Milo, come on, let's go, let's go, come on, time to go, yep, come on, yep, good boy, good boy. Yep, keep going, keep going, keep going, go, yeah. Yeah, time to lock up, let me give you some food. There you go, buddy. See you tomorrow.